I'm Kevin Fragish in Young Dundas Square. It is 420, but do you know where the term 420 actually came from? No, it is not a police code for marijuana. It is not the day that Bob Marley died. Tell you what, let's take a look at the origin of 420. I'll explain it to you in 60 seconds. Roll them. 420 comes from some high school kids, Louis Pasteur, The Grateful Dead, A Time of Day, and Where's Waldo? In the early 70s, a group of students at San Rafael High, no pun intended, formed, a, let's call it a social club, to meet up and smoke up. They would hang out by this wall, so they called themselves the Waldos. They would also gather after school near this statue of Louis Pasteur. Louis was a 19th century French biologist, microbiologist, and chemist, renowned for his discoveries of the principles of vaccination, microbial fermentation, and pasteurization. Anyway, the students would meet at the statue after school around 420. Aha! So they would say to each other in the hallway, Louis 420? In other words, code for meet at the statue after school to spark up some doobies. Soon they shortened it to just 420. As coincidence would have it, at the same time, the Grateful Dead moved out of San Francisco and into, yes, San Rafael, California. The Waldos hung out at the rehearsals and met other deadheads who adopted the term 420. And before long, the term 420 was no longer just code. It is, as you say, history. And there you go, the lesson of 420 and its origin. I wonder if anyone here will remember that. Kevin Fragish, Young Dundas Square, City News.